22 does, divvied them up amongst the bros, pinned them up together for two whole months. And when we separated, it was still three months that had to be waited. Now all their others are filling up. My wife says she's gonna go sit outside. She keeps saying the girls are she's looking mighty wide. It's getting time again. Let the birthing season begin. The big day's finally here. It's getting time again. Look at all the new gremlins. It's her favorite time of year. And we probably won't sleep for at least six weeks up early and outside all day long till they go to their new homes. It's getting time again. Let the birthing season begin. The big day is finally here. It's getting time again. Look at all the little gremlins. It's her favorite time of year. It's getting time. Hello, goat lovers. Crystal here with Blue Cactus Dairy Goats. And today we had something we did not expect. Lid Eye is going into labor five days early. So I thought it would be just another normal day since we're a few days out from kidding time technically. Um, you know, we had our normal day planned out. I was going to head to the post office, make the town run, no biggie. And um, came outside around 10 o'clock to recheck on the does before I took off and noticed Lid Eye was acting a little off. She was just kind of standing off to the side, looking a little posty legged, and I thought, maybe even a contraction what is going on and then she was starting to get a little talkative when she saw me um, and then she turned around and i noticed that her udder had doubled in size from last night so naturally i get in the pen and feel for ligaments and they're gone so lid i decided to go into labor five days early so I ran to the post office because uh, that needed to be done. And while I was at the post office, Derek put together this little pen for her so, so, so that we could get her out of the big pen um, because we're not quite done with the kidding stalls. But we had a few more days, we thought. Uh, but either way, we are doing pretty well because we had all of this stuff to throw together real quick and I had a hubby to do it for me while I was making a post office run. It's been an hour and a half since I noticed Lid Eye here was in labor, um, and it's actually progressing pretty quickly. Her contractions look like they're pretty strong, and not a lot of bedding down, just a couple times, but um, yeah, she's getting real posty in the legs. Like when they have a contraction, their vulva gets sunken in, and you know, real hard ones, they sink in. So I'm thinking we're gonna have babies on the ground within an hour or two. As far as her going five days early, it's totally okay because the babies are viable outside of the womb at 140 days, meaning their lungs are developed enough that they can come out and they can breathe. So I'm not worried about that. Um, plus maybe give a little relief to this girl here since she is a first timer. This is gonna be the first time she's ever had babies. Um, so, you know, five more days of baby growth in there. They're just gonna be a little bit bigger. So she's acting really calm, you know, as far as she's really, really um, appreciative that she has her own little pen now. And she, she is enjoying just the little pets and stuff to, to calm her down by me. And she's, uh, she's doing okay. So as far as big kids are concerned, I'm hoping she doesn't have a single because singles are a little bit bigger. You're going to do fine either way, though, girl, because she's super wide. She's fine. But... Um, her grandma, Lily, is, uh, her first time she had a baby was Lodi, and it was just Lodi, so she had a single, and then Lodi last year was the first time she had a baby, which was Lidi here, and it was just a single. I'm sorry. So, I don't know, she's not real, real huge looking, and I'm betting with the track record, um, that she might just have a single, so we'll have to see, huh, baby? I know you got this. You got this. Okay. She has got her liquor out a little bit. Once they start getting close, they they want to start licking things, like getting their tongue warmed up for cleaning off babies, huh, girl? She is pretty deep-bodied, though. She could be hiding too. 
I seen her talking on her right side too. You'll also see that when they're getting close. They, when they're laying down and stuff, they'll just kind of, well, this side, but talk to the babies. And she's doing all those things. It's actually quite the surprise she's going into labor today, but you just wanted to kick off kidding season early. Oh, I love you. Oh, you gonna bed down, girl? Yep, so you'll see a lot of this, pawing at the ground. Big udder. Yep. Oh, girl. So, there's no slime or anything yet, or mucus. Um, none of that has happened yet, but... Everybody gets mad when you call it slime. <laughs> yeah, I don't know why it is. It's slimy. So, if you want to get technical, it's mucus. The, the, the slimy mucus. Yeah. Oh. Contract it. Oh, that's even almost a slight push. So, yeah, I, like I said, I think this is going to go quite a bit sooner than... than later. Up, down, up, down. Yeah, that's a really hard contraction. Have time for a quick snack there, girl? mind off it. Stretching. She wants me. We became friends when I was setting up the stall. <laughs> <laughs> so I just went and got her and put her in here and then, then staked it all together and tied it all together. She was really happy to get out of the main pin. It's been a half hour and Lidai is still having some pretty hard contractions but they are getting a lot closer. So she is progressing nicely. You're doing good mama. You can talk to those babies. How are you? You're doing good. Just about another half hour and she's still having really close contractions, but nothing uh, too serious going on. Well, she wouldn't say that for sure. She's doing good, huh, baby? Oh, she has been stretching too to try to just get those babies aligned. I'm crossing fingers babies, so if you guys remember, I was saying one. You got this, Mama. I know. I was saying one baby. Okay. Oh, you're too sweet. I just love you. Oh, no? No? Okay. And Emily said two. I hope Emily's right. I do. I... She's just getting her liquor ready. <laughs> I don't need a bath. I don't. I do love you, though. I know, baby. Okay. Okay. Oh, oh, baby. Oh, she's using her teeth. You're using your teeth, girl. That's don't do wicked. don't do that on the babies. That's <laughs> <laughs> sweetie. We're getting there. All right. We look like some serious bedding down going on. Oh, 
little bit of heavy breathing, girl. Oh. They're coming. It's been about 10 minutes since she bedded down. She's got her leg kicked out here. It means it's really strong. She hasn't gotten back up though. This is the longest she has been bedded down so far. Oh, and I see mucus. Just barely, but it has started. Getting close, Mama. Okay, so it is now 125. We noticed she was in labor at 950. So close to four hours. When I see slime, typically within the hour, the babies will be on the ground. She did push just a couple times, but that wasn't serious hard pushing or anything like that. So if she was pushing hard, then I would expect to see babies within 30 minutes, but taking a little longer than I thought, but you're still doing just as you should. You're doing good, Mama. So it's been a bit. She's been standing. No more little pushes or anything like that. She does have a little more slime coming out. Um, let's say it's 1.45 now, so about 25 minutes since we've seen her try to push a little. Just a little wind. We're gonna lay back down. Now she's just uh, rethinking everything. Oh. It's like she knows she's on camera. So yeah, not a lot more slime. She's having a contraction now. But it's coming. She's going to deliver these babies with no assistance. It's going to be two, fingers crossed. Well, don't you know that's too much to ask for nowadays? <laughs> that's not. She could be hiding two little babies. You really, really easily forget how small they are when they're born. We got another pregnant goat, Abilene, over there in the pen. She sounds like a bullfrog. When they lay down and they're so full of babies, they're like, uh, uh. And now we wait for more pushes. Now it's serious. There's a bubble right there. She has been so calm and quiet, this little one. She's doing really good. You're a good girl. Now, if she's like Dreamer was last year, she's just going to lay here and not get up and just have all of her babies, like, boom, 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 not let out a scream. But that's only happened once, and that was with Dreamer, so. More pushes. Oh, yeah. Good girl, baby. See the bubble? Oh, baby. Oh. oh darn babies. Okay, 
I cannot tell yet. girl. Oh, you guys holding your breath with me? It's coming good, girl. I can't tell if that's the bubble or the baby sack. Typically the bubble comes out first. It looks like it is the bubble. Good girl, Mama. It's almost over. Oh, you poor baby. the kids say. Uh, the sun's so bright I can't tell the color. I don't see anything in it yet. I think they saw something. Could be a shadow though. Good job, little eye. Good job. He's doing it. Come on. A little tongue and a little nose. Good job, girl. Yes, and there's a hoof. Come on, girl. You're good. I only see one hoof. Come on. It's all right, girl. Two hooves, a nose, and a mouth. You are good to go, girl. You're good. Okay. I know. Oh, but I. Come on, you put. Oh. You're all right. Come on, one more push. There you go. You did it. You did it, Mama. Oh, you did it. You did good, baby. Okay. Look at the baby. All right. Hey, hey, hey. You're okay. You're okay. You did it. You did it. I know. Oof. <laughs> you did it. Good job, Mama. Good job. Yeah, what is that? That's what you were getting your liquor ready for. Oh. Here. There's your baby. There's your baby. Let's see. First one is... A doe. Good job. Oh. Get it out, sweet girl. A little twin. What is with you girls? You wanted to have a twin like your mama. Oh. And she's too little. Oh. Yeah, give her kisses. There you go. Oh. <laughs> You did good. Good job. Oh my goodness. Should I get one? I don't know. I don't know. 
Yeah, that feels, feels something hard in there. She's gonna have an, oh yeah, she's got another baby right there. Yes! She's, oh yeah, I was wrong. I'm glad I was wrong and it wasn't just one. <laughs> Good job. Oh, girl. We're on again. All right, here we go again, eh? Positioned perfectly and coming out like a pro. This one's a little bit bigger. It's probably a little boy. <laughs> hey. Yeah. Here we go. Hey. All right, give me the sucky, honey. Free. It's all right. It's all right. It's clearing its little mouth okay. Let me just help you. Oh, wow. Two does? How about two does? Wow. Two twin, almost twin. Do you see what? Wow. Another one? Oh, you're full of surprises. Let me get that down. Let's just get that. There we go. There's no way. Yes, two does. <laughs> Let me help you a little. There we go. Can you believe that lid eye? I think you're all done. That's perfect. Well, with everybody having a buck year, I'd say we're pretty lucky with two does to start out with. Precious Lita, you did so good. Perfect. Boy, that second one, you didn't even hesitate, huh? Glad the little one was first. These are little Vader babies. Too cute. Looks like this first one was just solid black. I didn't see any white anyway so far. Her ear a little bit. That's just her skin. Oh. Then the second one's got a little bit of white on her pole, on the top of her head. And a little white here on the side. We'll just have to see here in a little bit. I'm so proud of you, girl. Check it out. Little Miss Lida is a mama. Oh, it's tiring. This one here is going to be Lida's spitting image. I can tell she's going to be a chocolate because. Oh, yeah. Yeah, she's, she looks really black, and they typically are born black, the chocolates. 
but around her little eyes you can tell the shorter hairs it looks brown wow. she's gonna be her mama's twin she's already up oh oh goodness give us some time Slow girl down, baby <laughs> we're for like five seconds Just went right to being a good old mama. Oh, you're taking no time. Oh, look, there's a little white. Oh. Oh, she's got the L in her. Look at her, she's like, Mom, Mom, <laughs> Mom. I've been alive for two minutes. Hello. <laughs> But it's like, I don't know what's going on, but I think this is what I'm supposed to do. You're not using those teeth, are you? All right. <laughs> yeah, I think this one will stay black. Won't you? Okay. Okay, you're trying to. <laughs> She's like, Darren, will you feed me? <laughs> You're not starving. That's your mama starving. a minute. You're still wet. Okay, so Lidai is getting a little bit nervous. So we just got out of the pen. And they are all over the place. This has just literally been just a few minutes since they came out. Lidai is not wanting them to eat. She doesn't know what's going on. But she is attending to them, so that is really good. A couple of go-getters here. It is absolutely, oh, there you go, Mama. Oh. Just not sure about them trying to eat. Good girl, Lid Eye. She's like, let me clean you up. You want to make sure that you watch them eat the colostrum within the first 30 minutes, so 
If the little one she's cleaning off doesn't eat here soon, I will help her. Okay, get back on there, girl. There she goes. Good job, lid eye. Oh, you want to be the first? All right, so she has calmed down. They've eaten. They've done really well. This was the first girl born, and something you do after birth, especially right after, you know, shortly after, is you, I cut the umbilical cords and I spray it with iodine because that is technically an open wound, and you can already see it has some dirt on it, so you want to get at it pretty quick. Um, if dirt gets into their system or any bacteria, it can give them an infection and give them what's called joint ill and it can be very, very painful for them and kill them. It kind of just kind of swells their joints and again, really painful for them. So I have some sterilized scissors, surgical scissors. Just gonna cut it right there. And then, okay, the spray nozzle go on, let me make sure it's open. Thank you, it's not open. I should have opened it, I'm sorry. I'm almost done. You did so good, baby. Okay. There you go. All right, almost done. Okay, little. Let's give that a good squirt. It does sting a little, it is iodine, but it's necessary. If you've ever had a goat. Well, that was. That was quite the kiss. You're so Are you tired? Oh. Are you tired? Had a big day there. Oh, hi. Oh, I am in love with you. Oh. <laughs> oh, look at her. You did good, too. Yes, you did. <laughs> Well, I gotta do your sister, but now I don't want to put you down. Okay, that's it. Good job, baby. All right, let's get your... Oh, your lungs work. They do. Here you go, mama. You know what? Actually, something I also do. I just want to make sure the junk is looking good. They got a little bum. They got a little vagina or wiener. And only... Two teeth. Your perfection. Perfection. You're welcome. Good eye. I love you. She's so tired. So <laughs> she'll lay down over here. All right, lid eye. Okay, we're gonna make this fast, girl. Quit digging, lid eye. You're all right, let's get that cut. Quick little spray. That's it, you're done, you're done. Real quick, you guys, I just wanna show you. Look at this gray ear. I don't know if she wants that one. What is that, girl? That's adorable. How did you do that? I don't either. Junk. Looks perfect. Hold on, Lily. It's okay. Two teats. You're also perfection. Good job. Good job. Okay. Go back to Mama. There you go, Mom. All right, you guys, so that is a wrap for the first kids born for 2022. Even though it was a little early, everything went perfect. And starting off with two does, and Lid Eye's causing a dust storm over here. We're gonna get out of here. Thank you guys so much for watching. See you again soon. Bye, guys. All right, Dreamer is bedded down. This is looking pretty serious at this point. No more slime or anything like that. But there is rain, and the sun is pretty much down. So, if it rains any harder, I might have to uh, 
take these cameras in. So hopefully that's not the case, because she'll probably, probably deliver while it's pouring down rain. We'll just see. <laughs> 